<laughs> Did that look like he was trying to swap my camera? Or just like giving me like one of those like shoe? The old shoe symbol? IP2 always wins! All right, glorious and free. Western Convoy has many ethnic drivers, really? You see, that's what I uh, don't understand when I talked to the cabbie last night. There are a lot of ethnic drivers too. I wonder if that's why... He, uh, I'm gonna go back this way and tell the story for those who didn't hear it. The spikes on the wheels? You mean on, uh, like here? Those type of spikes? I used to have uh, shotgun shells as mine. Okay, so for those of you who weren't here earlier, last night when I shut the stream down, I had a poutine, and then I jumped in a cab, and uh, the cab was only a $17 ride back to my vehicle. But basically what happened was I jumped in the cab and I was like, hey man, how uh, is this protest affecting your, uh, your money? And he flipped right out. He's like, I can't remember exactly what he said verbatim now, but it was something to the effect of, uh, I wish that fucking convoy would have been down here when Uber was trying to take away my livelihood. He doesn't bother, he's not bothered by the truckers at all. And uh, I told him, well, why don't you get the cabbies down here and support them? You know, if we all support one another, when we have a cause that's <laughs> worth supporting, then we all, yes, Canada! Freedom! Liberty! Yeah, if we all have a cause worth supporting, and then we come out in numbers, the people have the power. We're changing things here. That is a big ass flag. That's the way you do it. Oh yeah! <laughs> that thing is huge. Liberty! <laughs> We need someone to honk for. It is extremely cold out here now. We're not sure how many people are left. Well, there's still quite a few people here. <laughs> Now that's a photo opportunity.
The diesel fumes in the air are friggin' thick tonight. Smells like freedom! Hold her till she blows! There you go, badass truck with a damn good message. Live it, beast. Liberty! Yes, sir! Freedom! I really hope I'm saying that with the proper accent or pronunciation. I'm not quite sure. I hope so, though. You're on the scanner? I never even thought about that. Alert. Look at Tracy Kent on Twitter. <laughs> Looks like we've got ourselves a convoy. Liberté. Okay, thank you very much. Merci beaucoup. Liberté. Liberté! Yeah, I love it. I absolutely love it. Oh, yeah. Man, this really looks like freedom. Look at this shit. Do you have any idea how busy this and serious this street usually is? And when I say busy, I mean busy with stuffiness. God forbid you crack a smile around here. Usually down here, nobody even really talks to each other because you don't know if you speak the right language. Uh, a lot of people are afraid to talk to anybody in case they're going to be asked for change because there's a lot of uh, homeless people down here and it's like, man, nobody cares about anything at all anymore. It's just us. We are one. Not just us here, but everywhere. All of us. We are one now. This is crazy. There is no way we can let this end. We will, I don't know, maybe in another lifetime, but I doubt we could ever do this again in mine. I never in a million years expected to see this. Not with this much love and support and success. It's, it's just crazy in how fast it happened. It was just like, damn, they got fed up one day and that was that. goodness it is such like a party down here i'm telling you that trailer full of uh subwoofers and speakers i showed you that thing is just booming yeah check this out that's awesome i've not seen this here before either there you go it seems like I keep seeing new trucks here that I haven't seen before. Maybe it has, I don't know. I've seen nothing but trucks for days and days and days. Drag race in reverse for freedom! That 
message says it all. That's what I'm worried about. They're going to protect the narrative instead of the people. Did they mark? Oh, sorry. Merci. I have no idea why I assumed that guy was French. Whoa. Look at this. We got another new one. Yeah, freedom! Woo! -hoo! Nuremberg 9 code. Yeah. That's a new truck. Ooh, whoa. Let's go see this one. Oh, that's the bathroom truck. Look, we got one there, waiting to exchange bathrooms, I bet ya. And another one right there. Those are probably the empty ones waiting to roll in to replace the full ones. And as you can see, there's not one damn thing on the ground. Not even a cigarette butt. Nothing. It's the cleanest Ottawa's ever been. At the world's most peaceful protest, and quite possibly, the world's most important. Uh, Porta potty. Johnny on the spot. There's a porta potty place down here in the Ottawa area, and it's called Johnny on the Spot. If you watch hockey, then you'll know what Johnny on the spot is. I don't watch much hockey, but I think what it is, is when you make a pass to somebody that's in front of the net and they get the goal, they call that Johnny on the spot. I could be wrong. You might want to uh, correct the dummy in chat. If you know better, give her. Clean as a whistle. That's right. It's amazing how clean it is. It's awesome. Like, good. God, it's so spotless down here that now is the time when you want to have this turn into a tourist destination. Let's get all of Canada down here. Please wear a mask. Look at this. Clean hands save lives. Please wear a mask. I didn't realize that was part of this. Whoops. All right. I'm not sure where we're going. We're uh, just going down here to check out the blockade because uh, there's obviously new trucks getting in. Does that mean that there's more held back and that sneaky guy with the Chevy just popped right through? Oh yeah. <laughs> climbing that little thing right there is like climbing a mountain right now. By the time this is done, I'm going to have frig friggin' legs like uh, a Clydesdale. All right. McDonald's is closed. Yep. Not so only 10% effective. Speaker alert.
Oh, she's got nothing of interest to say. I don't even know what she's saying. Oh, she's crying. She just came out of the subway though, not the protest. She's not one of us. Uh, 75% of statistics are made up on the spot. Pray for her. She seems like she needs some praying. No doubt about that. Uh, I'm not quite sure if I've ever seen anybody tweaked out that bad in real life. That was uh, something else. She's a pretty small woman, but uh, she was tweaking hard. Who knows what she's capable of with that superhuman tweak strength. I don't really feel like fighting with a woman, especially a super violent, squeaky friggin' tweaker. <laughs> Look at this. There we go. There we go. United. I'm just waiting across the street. She threw coffee at a trucker today? What, did she? See, that's exactly what I don't need. I had a hot chocolate in my pocket yesterday. I don't really want a freaking coffee on my head or anywhere on me. Dude, I'm clearly waiting for you to fucking go so I can cross. It's weird, even the people in cars need to stop in front of the camera. Some people love it, and some people have a magnetic attraction to it. And some people absolutely hate having it around. Thankfully, pretty much everybody down here is uh, cool with what's going on with the cameras. Oh. All right, I'm gonna park you here for a minute. Looks like a group of Antifa arrived, really? No, cover, uh, no. As far as I know, the farmers are not. I've never heard of anything like that. <laughs> 